The Woodland Luxury Apartments, Fable Town, late. And we're back. Yay. Yay. Go to your cycle. Oh. <laughs> Funny thing, too. He lives at Woodland Luxury Apartments. I actually used to live in a neighborhood that, like, when I was in high school, that was called um, Woodland Hills. <laughs> May not have been apartments, but it, uh, I was in the Woodland Hills. Okay, I'm gonna do this again since I restarted the game again. Yeah, I guess shoes by Cinderella would have been too obvious. Oh, yeah, the high end Eggman diner. Alright. Since it won't let me go across the street because it's mean. Alright. Let's go look at the sign. Luxury yep. apartments. I wish they wouldn't advertise that. Ding! Hmm. Didn't you have a bloody nose before? The me turning off the game, then coming back, like, two minutes later. Like, get rid of your bloody nose. And just gave you a bruise and a cut right there, or that part of your face, I don't know. Just give you bruises. <laughs> okay, I swear you had a bloody nose, but maybe I'm dreaming? I don't know. I'll have to go back and look. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, 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 it closed. I think. Oh, yeah, I can look at that. Just keep on grass. <laughs> or stay off the grass. Sometimes be a disciplinarian. Snow. Oh, Snow White. Ah, hi. Go to the door. Just go inside. What the fuck was that? But Who's that? He's like, who the fuck are you? Stay off the grass. There's no walking on the grass. No white's orders. She made a sign and everything. <laughs> it's so pretty. Who are you? I'll be sure to send her an apology. Beauty. Ah. Hello, baby. Beauty, Belle, whatever the fuck you want to go by. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. Why did Why'd you hide? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, you can't. No, you can't. Damn it, I'm late. Where are you going? <laughs> Where are you going? Where's Beast? Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Um. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Eh, sure. I promise. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. I just said a promise. I didn't say I promise, but tell me later. Whatever. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I I appreciate it, Bigby. He's like, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> okay. Whatever. I don't care. Do your own thing. The night just popped. I hope y'all didn't hear that. <laughs> what the fuck? Wake up, dude. What's your, what's your name tag say? Hey, you wink? Grimble? Hmm, probably for the best. Who the fuck is Grimble? Huh. I need to go bang on it, maybe we'll wake him up. He's out of it. I need to go look up on my story. Fairy tale stuff. I don't remember who he is. Dust this guy. Flycatcher. I need to, yeah, I need to look up. I don't remember who any of these people are. Well. Some of these. Wee. 
Okay, done. I'm sorry. <laughs> Go. Been a while since I got any mail. You have mail? I like how his is the only off colored one. Seventh day in a row. No. Dory. No mail for the big red wolf. Let's see who all lives here. There's Beast. A lot of private. Blue Horner. What the f? What the fuck? Oh, what's that? Oh, he did. Oh, oh, okay. Go. Get it. Damn thing fell off again. Yeah, sorry. Put it back on there. How much longer is this gonna go on? Was that who was that under him? Hold on. You think the sheriff would get a permanent listing? <laughs> you don't say anything else. Who's Rumble? Rumble. I think the sheriff would get a permanent <laughs> listing. Uh, whatever. Let's go. Hold on. Okay, I see the thing go. Is there anything else to do over here before I go? Not to check everything. Okay, because you don't need to look at that again. All right. Whoa, there you go. Uh, I'm sorry, I accidentally hit the hit the button to move. Am I awake? I dance. Da -da 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 -da. You didn't even let me dance. Darn. Okay. Who's that? Who's that? Big B. Oh, hey, it's probably Beast, isn't up. it? Because of the ears. It's kind of pointy. Have you seen my wife? Yep. Have you seen Beauty? Fuck, I said I... Nope. I haven't seen it. Nope. I haven't seen her. Oh. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. You have very pointy ears. But I guess that's because of the Beast side. Or whatever. There's his two or four. A four looks like it's about to come off. Because that's what everybody does. <laughs> Get your window looks like it was already open to begin with. Whatever. Mm. I wish I could do that. Have a bruise on my face, just wipe it off with some water, and be good. I wish I could do that. Ooh, can I look at this? No? I wanna look at the note! <laughs> Alright, go through them. <laughs> Get some food. Why do I even own this? Should've got a smaller one. Ketchup and cigarettes. The best combination ever, I guess. <laughs> Is there anything else over here? Nope, just look at it closer. Okay. What's this? Blue beer folder. Who the fuck's a blue beard? File. Never trusted this guy. Who the f I yeah, I really need to go. Can you go in any of these rooms? I really need to go look up some of these fairy tales and wow. <laughs> That's funny. I don't even know who Bluebeard is. I don't even remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. At least this still works. <laughs> You're gonna turn it on or try to turn it on it's not gonna work. Watch. Uh oh. Should 
Okay, what? Okay, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna walk. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god! Oh my god, he's snoring. What? That sounds like my dog snoring. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, not again. I guess that's why the health smells. Wake up. Hey, Colin. Get up. Colin's like, fuck you, I'm sleeping. A big ass chair. Oh, hey, Big B. Hi. I'm in your chair, huh? Maybe. Come on, I'm tired. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. Oh, where's he gonna go? <laughs> I guess he's one of the three little pigs, although he's not fucking little, but you know, whatever. Now we just stare at each other. Got a smoke? No. Is he gonna give him a Oh my god. A fucking smoking pig. That's awesome. Thanks. Couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has gotta stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Big B. No, I'm not. Calm down. I'm not sending you back. That for me? Nope. <laughs> the house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. I just want that to rest. was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. I was just hungry. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well, I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would if you could. <laughs> you probably. probably. See? Yes, you would. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. He just said he was hungry. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories, either. <laughs> Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. No, oh, that's my job. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables? Sometimes I take him to the farm. Fuck you. Hey! I didn't say I was gonna take you to the farm. I said I wouldn't. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. And being By wolf. being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. For you? <laughs> or him. <laughs> That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, not everyone. Name one. Mm. Mm, I was nice to Beauty. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah. That's real nice of you. Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Does it Well, does it maybe snow if married? my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Is she married Wait, to that the... doesn't make Just sense. give me a drink, please. To the prince Colin, or whatever? Enough already. I haven't slept in two days. 
I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I just give him the goddamn drink. <laughs> Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right, probably. Give him the drink. Oh yeah, isn't Snow supposed to be married or something to whatever prince it was that saved her? Or did he not make it out of their homelands, I guess? Whatever. I don't care. Oh my god. Mm. Kinda like it how they make him the one wolf that did everything to everybody. Instead of making like separate wolves. Like they've done before. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Oh, he looks very pissed. I'm coming, god, god damn it. That's right, straighten out that tie. <laughs> Big B. Hi. No. Hi. Come with me. Snow. She's not happy. Snow. What? Sorry, I'm... What is it? Where are we going? Where are we going? Out in front of the building. We have to get there. Hi. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Or evening. <laughs> yeah. That wasn't awkward. What is that, though? Hmm. These walls are paper thin. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. Okay. I like that her on her shirt it actually has snowflakes. There, see? That's pretty cool. What the fuck is that? that there a dead animal under there or something I mean she would be the one to freak out about a dead animal although I would freak out about a dead animal too but I mean is it a dead animal though it's really since it's under a jacket uh oh oh ew oh god that girl Oh lord. You knew this girl? Yeah, I gave her money. Is what the fuck? She's not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. She's a working girl. A working girl? A working girl? I don't I mean, I'm a working Oh. You're not that kind of working girl. He attacked her, I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... Terrible. Did you see anyone? So, did you see anyone else? No. No one. No cabs, no voices, Mondays? Maybe, but... No. I don't think so. I would remember. Okay. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. Hmm. <laughs> That's not cool. She's an awesome prostitute because she saved my life. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with magic attached to it. Or at least, you know, not really saved my life, at least saved her. Saved him from, um,. Changing into an actual wolf, losing his glamour and whatnot. What is? That her ribbon? That's what it looked like. 
Yeah, it is. Oh. It's her ribbon. The ring. There's some kind of symbol here. Hmm. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. That's the ring she's wearing, wasn't it? It look it looks like it is. I think it was, yeah. Okay. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. What kind of monster would do this? Sorry, this is just so surreal. <sighs> um, what, what do you want to do next? Investigate more. I mean, why, why the fuck would you leave? We still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Want anything to say to me? Hey, Snow. You alright? Yes. Thanks. But you should hurry. We don't have much time left. We should head back inside soon. Bitch, the game won't progress until I do stuff. Okay, this is the... Yeah, this is the blood I saw. The fuck is that? Well, first... <laughs> touch the blood. Sniff it out! Blood. Drops is it her blood, blood or someone else's blood? Say it's been here an hour, maybe. Dude, sniff it out. You're a wolf. No signs that it's been here long. Hate that it keeps moving the cursor over here. Fabric looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Oh god, is there a body in a trash can? Just some loose trash. Are you sure? Ah! Okay. More blood. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, then left the trail I found earlier. Touch it. Blood. Still wet. Sharp enough. Looking back at the trash again? Surprised the garbage men can even find their way here. <laughs> okay. Um anything at the entrance, maybe? Cause uh, that's the door to go back in. I'll talk to you in a second again. God damn it. There we go. There. Are you sure? And okay, just taking me to the door. Wonder can you go over there? Nah. He doesn't know what to do. He's by you snow. He's so confused. Alright. I don't I don't think there's anything to do. Nope. Can't even go over there. Okay. <laughs> Where the fuck is my mouse going? <laughs> I'm not even moving it. Hold on. Did I talk to you again? Hey, it's not. You alright? Oh, I keep forgetting space is paused. I'm really not sure how much time we have. Ah! Uh, whatever. Do it. What are you doing? I'm not looking up your skirt. Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. I wasn't looking up your skirt. I, I promise. What does it mean? We should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. 
Pigby, do you have any idea what's going on? Mm. How did this happen? I don't want to say yet. Uh, her. Sorry, Snow. Just not ready to say yet. Fine. Let's just get upstairs. Oh, fuck you, Snow. <laughs> I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. Who the fuck is Crane? As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway. Whatever. So we may as well get out in front of it. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. Dr. Swinehart? Oh, is it one of the little pigs? Hmm. Okay. Well, now we're back inside. There's that one guy. What, are you blind? Maybe. What, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck I you work like. here. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. You know what? Fuck you, dude. Fucker. <laughs> Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course Don't I do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. You asked me a question. Don't change the you subject. Did. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. She didn't kill her. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things no running one's to blame, really. around here. This is a disaster. It isn't anyone's fault. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, is that how you see things? Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure it. to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have uh, he was the last to see fire the both of you. The woodsman is a person of interest. From what we've been able to gather, he was last seen with the victim. The woodsman? That drunk wretch was the cause of this? It's a lead. Nothing's certain yet. Well, find him. Get him in here if that's all you have to go on. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer amongst us. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Could, uh, Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Weirdo. Don't bother. Forget it. Can't do anything right. Do your job, Sheriff. Fuck or you! We'll find someone who can. <laughs> I'm just not gonna say anything. God damn, I didn't even get to say it. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. Well, that could have gone better. Well, maybe we should have dragged it out. For what it's worth, I still think it was better to tell him. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and- And I give two shits? Never mind. Smoke away. He gets a morning Who massage? He gets a massage this early. Crane. It doesn't really matter the time of day. A mere scent of stress, and he's out the door. What the fuck? Is... is he gone? Yes, thankfully. Oh my god, it's a flying monkey! I think he has the wine that you got. <laughs> Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? No it way. was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Maybe. 
<laughs> oh, that's funny. Hi. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? <laughs> oh, I don't want to be mean. I'm, I'm fine. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. I'm not sure that was any more specific. Bring the first three. Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. Are you There's sure? bound to be information on her here. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. Oh! We really have to get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. I'll just come poke Hello, you. Hi, this is Snow White, Mr. Crane's assistant. Hi, yes, I'm just calling to let you know that um, Mr. Crane's schedule seems to have filled up for the rest of the day, and he's coming in early for his appointment. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before then? Or what he did to get them. Yes, that's right. Mm-hmm. No, we got your invoice. Yes. It should be squared away. Yep. Strength. I guess it comes yeah. in all forms. And look at that. It's you. There's you on there. You know what it is. Yes. I mean, I questioned it only due to the amount. It seemed a bit excessive. Mm hmm. I have the record right here. Give me one moment. Well, that's not what I have here. I can look through it again and get back to you. <gasps> oh my mm. god, bitch. Really? <laughs> oh god. I'll be sure to let him know. Yes. That's not a problem. Damn. Oh god. Just what the fuck is this supposed to mean? Yes, let's take the tarot card. She said she was going to look at the record, and yet she didn't. She just stood there staring off in space. Like, really? I'll do the mirror last. I'm going to go look around first. Oh, hello. Can I look at these? Of course not. Oh, why would I be able to? Oh, look, there's your desk. Hi. Can I show you this card? Ah, oh, got stuck on the desk. Okay, yeah, I'm about to say there's this I could look at. Is there a genie in it? Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. Oh. Never mind. I still want to touch it. Worth a try. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Look at that mirror. Look at her. What the f Is that cotton hook shit behind you? What the hell? Hey, magic mirror. I got a question. You know the rule. Mm -hmm. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel but have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See? Was that so <laughs> That's a cute little rhyme. I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? Mm -hmm. Woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? <laughs> I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. Mm. I'm probably mad. I don't know her name. 
Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. She, whatever. If you get the Show books. Me Bufkin. Hey, <laughs> put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> no shit. Uh, she's whatever. Let's see. Show me Snow White. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. So was fucking Buffkin. Whatever. Nobody right now. <laughs> very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else or someone new. God. Oh, there goes the ship. Yeah, I think that is Cotton Hook's ship. He's got the books, though. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, now I gotta walk over there. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I can ask him... I can ask him about the card. Okay. Take it. You know what this means? Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. Not when you've been so helpful. Hmm. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear as a window. Are you sure? <sighs> Whatever. You're not going to tell me jack shit, are you? Ah, I'm stuck in her desk. Book of symbols. Oh, you're Cinderella. Maybe. Let's go to the. There's the. What's one? Go to the beginning. What the fuck is that? Whatever. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. <laughs> What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Not quite who I'm looking for. <laughs> I like how if you saw when Buffkin landed, Snow's just pretty much looking at the table at a closed book. Not doing shit. There's a woodsman's axe. This looks familiar. Yes, from the axe of the woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone blessed that thing. I only translate. Mm. Oh, wow. Hmm. What's it say about that? It says brickle bit in an older elvish hand. What's brickle bit? A magic word. What's it do? Makes animal shit gold. <laughs> no comment on that one. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. What the fuck? That's a lot of earth. Bufkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. <laughs> nothing about... Okay, nothing about Cinderella. Oh, well that's the mark right there. Hold on. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that, but I have a cup over here with some ice, and apparently the ice just settled and it, like, just moved, and I freaking heard it. I thought my door was opening for a second or something. Okay, well, so it's this. It's the ring. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairairo? I'll go look it up. Alairairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Oh, there yes. she is. What does it say? Donkey skin girl, Please, also known as younger. donkey skin, younger version. also known as 
Raskin. <laughs> uh, prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. Thank you. The story of Donkey Pien. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Uh, his daughter, Faith. Oh, that's just wrong. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Aww. That's sad. In so many ways. There's Cinderella over there. What the fuck is going on with her? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Mm, we gotta go tell him she's dead. We got dead. what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than... Her name me. was Faith. Yeah. We should talk to the husband. You think he did it? No, I don't. But we need to let him know about his wife. The face. I mean, normally, when if like a husband or wife is like found dead, they you always go for the spouse first. But I mean, just try to be nice. Just say, yeah, we just need to go talk to him. <laughs> just need to notify him. What the? F what the? F what the f Girl, get on it! Oh my god! Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. We already know her name, but feel free to have a look if you like. Girl, I'll look all I want, you little bitch. Hey, look, there's you. Oh, Big B. Me. Oh, big ass oof. And him. The woodsman? Yep, and his axe. I wonder um, if Red's around. I wonder if we'll see her. It'd be pretty awesome. Yeah, the two of them. <laughs> I wonder what the story was. There's you. You're getting warmer, but that's me. Bitch, I just want to look. God, God, Snow, you, you're being a little bitch right now. Just let me. My, what? Whatever. Yeah, dwarves. The less said about that, the better. God, I just want to look at everything. You don't have to give me little comments on every little thing, Snow. I like how she's holding it like it was a mask. I don't even look. Whatever. And her man. Beast. Funny. No! Please continue! I wanna know what's so freaking funny about that. Well, there's Faith right there because of the little donkey skin thing. Colin and his brothers. I'll do them last. Hey! Look at that. Oh, God. God, that asshole. Ichabod Crane. Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. <laughs> well, maybe it's time that changed. Okay, hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll go look at her in a second. Huh. Nice hat. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. Hmm. Okay. Who the f Who are you? Whatever. Yeah, that's her all right. Long time ago. Poor thing. Okay, so we... What the... Everything. I wish you could look at that. Looked at everything, right? Maybe? It seems so, yeah. Okay. Back out. Alright, um... 
What do I need to do? Oh, yeah, we are there. Uh, learn to speak words first. Um, we know our name now. So we can go talk to him now, right? Or at least we should be able to. Maybe? Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. <laughs> of which fable do you wish to know? <laughs> okay, um... Let's go with her father first. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Oh, he's dead. There's his ring. I guess that crosses him off the suspect list. I sort of rhymed. I didn't mean to, though. Okay. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Ooh! Is he dead? What's he been doing? He looks dead. Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Okay. He looks like he killed himself or something. I don't know. It's because of all the... Show me... Uh, show me faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts conceal. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. That's what she fucking said. What? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Whitney. It's simply the way this has to be. Well, okay. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Ring, ring, bitch, ring, ring. Sorry, I have to get that. I should go get it. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I. He is. Hold on, Bigby. It's for you. Bigby. Oh God. It's me. Hello. What the fuck? You there? The car? Sorry about the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. Big B. Shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! Ooh. That didn't sound that good at all. Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be he in trouble. He looks dead already. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. No. Whenever you're ready. Toad sounded a little dire right there because it sounded like someone was about to like attack him or something. And the Prince Lawrence, the way he was, he looks like he's dead already. Maybe whoever killed Faith killed him. Go, bitch. You know, I liked you in the beginning, but then your little comments on every little thing were starting to annoy me. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, oh, where to first? Oh, fuck me. Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Um. <laughs> oh god, I have to pick. Um. I'm gonna just go and say this. I love you guys, but I'm gonna end it here for right now, and I'll be right back, and you get to see what I choose. <laughs> Bye!